I'd like to inform you uh, that driving test centers for the theory in a UK Great Britain they are open from the 4th of July and full-fledged you can take a test currently uh, all the driving test center which are open which is for the car theory with a uh, social distancing some restrictions are placed for the health and safety for all of us now when we uh, seen the test is being taken in the london region uh, quite a few students of mine which i have taken a test in fact on the first day when the test is open they have informed us and informed me that the test is conducting but it is very quiet the test center when they arrive they have to arrive 15 minutes before but they're not allowing them just before the test about five to ten minutes before when they arrive the complete social distancing is taking place no handshakes you present your license first when you start when you arrive in the place and then after that checking all the documents uh, they will be following the procedure which is all the country is observing currently uh, in the test center it's complete social distancing you must keep your space throughout while you are enter the premises till you exit as well in the premises will be uh, guidelines which you have to follow and it's very strict guidelines I'm not scaring you but I'm telling you what the guidelines which we are following throughout the whole country when you arrive over there there will be a, a systematic way that one by one do it at the moment currently they are not taking 100% only 50% uh, capacity they will take you in when you arrive over there after checking your license they will provide you obviously a locker where you keep your all belongings safe they will provide you a uh, sanitary wipes which you can uh, clean all the lockers inside to make it uh, uh, safer from all the viruses on what we are going through currently and they will provide you a sanitary uh, hand wipes alcoholic wipes all, all the things which is make it keep safe at the premises you will be keep apart two meters definitely you have to keep it uh, a safe distance and uh, basically you need to follow the new guidelines these guidelines will remain place for six to 12 months this is currently informed us six to 12 months and that will be keeping all the way uh, throughout the test you are not allowed to uh, go or meet with other students we used to when you are in a waiting area you will have a conversation asking and you're sharing your experience and the thoughts about the theory itself but currently you are not you have to keep a distance throughout again same thing you keep your belongings inside the test center before you start the test you have to wipe clean wear the mask and then the test will start same thing when you finish you have to do the same you have to clean wipe and everything when you take your belongings when you're leaving the test center as well so it is very current and strict you are not allowed to use the toilet facilities in the test center for the safety reasons that's what they have informed us and the student have informed us as well when you're taking a test there will be a complete social distance between you and others so there was used to be uh, people sitting next to not next to each other but there will be uh, like a boxes which you keep uh, uh, aware of it that somebody is next to you but at the moment there will be a complete social distancing there will be a not person sitting next to you at the moment currently they are only running with a 50 person could be a little bit less than uh, uh, about 50 I would say the 50% of uh, the whole booking system, they are going ahead. If they have 100, they're only operating a 50. So this is the current situation and I'm sure that you're always aware of it. There's lots of things you can find them online. So the test has been completely changed for, for us to keep it safe. 
Now today's mock test, I have bring you uh, one of the very, very important 50 questions. I have completed the whole mock test for you. In this mock test, particularly the five questions which I come across, which I'm definitely sure you will receive in your day of the test. So watch this video till the end and the end of this video, I'm sharing with you one of the best app. Let's go for today's mock test video. Which is the sign for a ring road? What requires extra care when you're driving or riding in windy conditions? Using the brakes Passing pedal cyclists Moving off on a hill Turning into a narrow road At an incident, it's important to look after any casualties. What should you do with them when the area is safe? Give them something to eat. Move them away from the vehicles. Keep them where they are. Ask them how it happened. What's the most important reason for having a properly adjusted head restraint? To help you maintain your driving position. To help you avoid neck injury. To help you relax. To make you more comfortable. Following a collision, a person has been injured. What would be a warning sign for shock? Rapid shallow breathing. Slow pulse. Flushed complexion. Warm dry skin. You arrive at the scene of a motorcycle crash. No other vehicle is involved. The rider is unconscious and lying in the middle of the road. What's the first thing you should do at the scene? Give the rider reassurance. Clear the road of debris. Warn other traffic. Move the rider out of the road. Powered vehicles used by disabled people are small and can be hard to see. What must they display if they are traveling on a dual carriageway? Flashing amber beacon. Flashing red beacon. Flashing blue beacon. Flashing green beacon. What should you do if you're towing a trailer and it starts to swing from side to side? Accelerate until it stabilizes. Ease off the accelerator to reduce your speed. Brake hard and hold the pedal down. Let go of the steering wheel and let it correct itself. Where's the safest place to park your vehicle at night? On a busy road. In a garage. Near a red route. In a quiet car park.
Your vehicle breaks down on a motorway and you manage to stop on the hard shoulder. What should you do if you use your mobile phone to call for help? Stand at the rear of the vehicle while making the call. Check your location from the nearest marker posts beside the hard shoulder. Phone a friend and ask them to come and collect you. Wait in the car for the emergency services to arrive. What does this sign mean? No traffic from the right. Road on the right closed. No right turn. Bend to the right. You're following a cyclist. What should you do when you wish to turn left a short distance ahead? Hold back until the cyclist has passed the junction. Overtake the cyclist before you reach the junction. Go around the cyclist on the junction. Pull alongside the cyclist and stay level until after the junction. Where would you find these road markings? At a mini roundabout. On a pedestrian crossing. On a motorway. At a railway crossing. You've stopped at a railway level crossing. What should you do if the red lights continue to flash after a train has gone by? Wait. Phone the signal operator. Proceed with caution. Alert drivers behind you. You need glasses to read a vehicle number plate at the required distance. When must you wear them? Only in bad weather conditions. Whenever you're driving. When you think it's necessary. Only at night time. Why should you allow extra room while overtaking a motorcyclist on a windy day? The rider may turn off suddenly to get out of the wind. The rider may be traveling faster than normal. The rider may stop suddenly. The rider may be blown in front of you. You're at a junction controlled by traffic lights. When should you wait at a green light? When your exit from the junction is blocked. When you think the lights may be about to change. When pedestrians are waiting to cross. When you intend to turn right. What information would be shown in a triangular road sign? Keep left. Road narrows. Minimum speed. Ahead only.
What's the purpose of triangular shaped signs? To give orders. To give directions. To give warnings. To give information. You've broken down on a two-way road. You have a warning triangle. At least how far from your vehicle should you place the warning triangle? 100 meters 328 feet 5 meters 16 feet 25 meters 82 feet 45 meters 147 feet What can seriously reduce your ability to concentrate? Weather conditions Drugs Busy roads Tinted windows You're in a tunnel and you see this sign. What does it mean? Beware of pedestrians, no footpath ahead. Direction to an emergency pedestrian exit. Beware of pedestrians crossing ahead. No access for pedestrians. What can people who live or work in towns and cities do to help reduce urban pollution levels? Drive short journeys. Drive more quickly. Walk or cycle. Over rev in a low gear. What could you do to help injured people at an incident? Keep them on the move by walking them around. Give them something to eat. Give them a warm drink. Keep them warm and comfortable. Why should you check the information leaflet before taking any medicine? The medicine you take may affect your hearing. Some types of medicine can affect your ability to drive safely. Drug companies want customer feedback on their products. You may have to let your insurance company know about the medicine. Which diagram shows a hazard warning line? Who is authorized to signal you to stop? A police officer. A bus driver. A motorcyclist. A pedestrian. Where would parking your vehicle cause an obstruction? On your driveway. Alongside a parking meter. In front of a property entrance. In a marked parking space. What should you do if you start to feel drowsy while you're driving on a motorway? Speed up to arrive at your destination sooner. Slow down and let other drivers overtake. 
Open a window and stop as soon as it's safe and legal. Stop on the hard shoulder for a sleep. Which sign means, no stopping. You're following a large vehicle as it approaches a crossroads. What should you do if the driver signals to turn left? Overtake if you can leave plenty of room. Wait for the vehicle to finish turning. Overtake if there are no oncoming vehicles. Wait for the driver to cancel his signal. You're reversing into a side road. When would your vehicle be the greatest hazard to passing traffic? After you've completed the maneuver. When the front of your vehicle swings out. After you've entered the side road. Just before you begin to maneuver. What should you do if you're being followed by an ambulance showing flashing blue lights? Maintain your speed and course. Accelerate hard to get away from it. Brake harshly and stop well out into the road. Pull over as soon as it's safe to do so. After a collision, someone is unconscious in their vehicle. When should you call the emergency services? After you've woken them up. After checking for broken bones. As soon as possible. Only as a last resort. What does this sign mean? Lane for heavy and slow vehicles. All lorries use the hard shoulder. Leave motorway at next exit. Rest area for lorries. What does it mean if your insurance policy has an excess of 500 pounds? The insurance company will pay the first 500 pounds of any claim. You'll have to pay the first 500 pounds of the cost of any claim. You'll be paid 500 pounds if you don't claim within one year. Your vehicle is insured for a value of 500 pounds if it's stolen. Why is it more difficult to overtake a large vehicle than a car? A large vehicle will have air brakes. It will take longer to overtake a large vehicle. A large vehicle will be fitted with a speed limiter. It will take longer for a large vehicle to accelerate. When may you stop on an urban clearway? To use a mobile telephone. To load or unload goods. To ask for directions. To set down and pick up passengers.
What should you do if your vehicle catches fire while you're driving through a tunnel? Pull up, then walk to an emergency telephone. Leave it where it is, with the engine running. Park it away from the carriageway. Drive it out of the tunnel if it's safe to do so. How will a roof rack affect your car? The engine will use more oil. Fuel consumption will increase. The car will accelerate faster. There will be less wind noise. What shape is a stop sign? What should you do when you're overtaking a motorcyclist on a windy day? Pass widely. Pass immediately. Pass very slowly. Pass closely. Which sign means there will be two-way traffic crossing your route ahead? What can you do to reduce environmental damage caused by your vehicle? Avoid making a lot of short journeys. Avoid using the cruise control. Use the gears to slow the vehicle. Use the air conditioning whenever you drive. What must you do when the amber light is flashing at a pelican crossing? Give way to pedestrians already on the crossing. Give way to pedestrians waiting to cross. Stop and wait for the red light. Stop and wait for the green light. Road and traffic signs. It's still dark and Sophie has an early start in the morning traveling to work at another office. She takes the motorway route and notices the various reflective studs on the road. Leaving the motorway, Sophie sees a police car flashing its headlights at the car in front. The traffic now gets busier and Sophie needs to make a right turn but she thinks her signal might not be seen because of the heavy traffic. Getting nearer to town, Sophie passes a row of parked cars and is aware that someone is about to step out between the cars. She sounds her horn. Closer to the office, Sophie has to travel down a narrow residential road and adjusts her speed to suit. Where would Sophie see amber reflective studs on the motorway? On the right-hand edge of the road. On the left-hand edge of the road. Separating the lanes. Separating the slip road from the motorway.
there is a police car following you and the police officer flashes the headlights and points to the left. What should you do? Turn left at the next junction. Move over to the left. Stop immediately. Pull up on the left. When may Sophie sound the horn? To give her right of way. To attract a friend's attention. To warn others of her presence. To make slower drivers move over. When Sophie is signaling to turn right in busy traffic how could she confirm her intention safely? Sound the horn. Give an arm signal. Flash her headlights. Position over the center line. In some narrow residential streets Sophie may find a speed limit of 40 mph 20 mph 25 mph 35 mph Which is the sign for a ring road? You're at a junction controlled by traffic lights. When should you wait at a green light? When your exit from the junction is blocked. When you think the lights may be about to change. When pedestrians are waiting to cross. When you intend to turn right. What information would be shown in a triangular road sign? Keep left. Road narrows. Minimum speed. Ahead only. You've broken down on a two-way road. You have a warning triangle. At least how far from your vehicle should you place the warning triangle? 100 meters 328 feet 5 meters 16 feet 25 meters 82 feet 45 meters 147 feet which diagram shows a hazard warning line Congratulations all of you completed a 50 questions 
and all of you answer a 50 out of 50 well done for that some of you found a little bit difficult and trust me after these 50 questions all of yours all of the in every single of you your knowledge has increased and these are the questions which you have covered they are quite hard and bit tricky let's come towards to this uh, special uh, clip which I'm making and adding for you at the end of this video driving test success is a one of the best app in the market in the UK Great Britain which you can download and practice official questions from the DVSA for the UK car theory test in this you will have uh, activate the pass guarantee and you will get the money back if you are not successful you have to follow the criteria they give you five mock tests consisting you have to pass all the practice questions are here with the one click each category so you go through it and completed all the questions one by one after that you can take a mock test the same mock test which i have done it now which you can see it all those questions they are exactly questions including a scenario or situation based at the last five questions you will get in your actual theory day same time the questions which you want to search afterwards if you think is uh, you need to practice more you can type in the questions will come up or while you are reading or are doing a mock test or a study and you can uh, save your questions which comes in a my question which will give you a whole list of the questions which you like to read again there will be those your questions and they will be there for you till you complete confident and release them from the my questions list then after that at the drop down you will see a progress monitor it will keep your progress individually for the every mock test the areas which you are reading like a practicing categories by categories will give you a feedback and tells you where you are stands underneath you will see a stopping distance every one of us finding a difficulty to find a stopping distance because this is the calculation a mathematic which you do hit or you can memorize it based on the speed 30 40 50 60 70 miles and a stopping distance in a rain or a dry condition as well same time it will give you help and support this is the app i've been using since 2000 actually this is uh, i've been using since 2003 but it was in a cd room and i used to give it to my students to practice and pass uh i've been instructed since 2003 and, and this app uh it's changed it from cd rom to an app now everybody can download to into their android or ios phone uh i want to help all of you every single of you every single of the person in the uk great britain to pass the theory test first time uh i cannot go and find everyone because i have a limited of time myself to teach everyone so please spread this word and share this video, like this video, subscribe and click on the channel and click on the bell icon so you will get the all new notifications or new videos regularly. I'm making a video on a regular basis and you will get them. I'm on a mission to help as many as people to pass theory and the practical test for the UK Great Britain. So please help me and share this video. See you in the next video. Till then, you look after yourself and Lord of this universe bless you with lots of love happiness and success. Amen.